I'm speaking at the LBMA in Barcelona on gold versus Bitcoin. This question has been asked many times of what is the difference between them. Specifically, gold is a store of value that lasts forever. Bitcoin, on the other hand, is something that's young and it's speculative. It's very exciting, but really the comparison with gold has been overdone. I'm going to explain why the two are quite different. So can you give us a bit of an insight into why you think they're different? Gold and Bitcoin on the supply side are very, very similar. Indeed, the Bitcoin network was designed around the idea of gold. That is why they're so similar. However, on the other hand, the demand side is completely different. So for gold, it's a long-term store of value, um, which is driven by inflation. On the other hand, Bitcoin is, is driven by the network effect. And so it's more similar to a, to a social media stock than it is to a precious metal. And for people who are kind of looking at how it's going to work out in the end, What's going to come out more strongly? I question four extreme economic scenarios. In a strong growth envi environment where all's well, speculation is rife, no doubt the audience will be voting for Bitcoin. However, in the adverse, in the, in the, in the adverse, in the adverse scenarios, such as inflation, nuclear war, or even socialism, I suspect most of the audience will favor gold over Bitcoin. Why do you think that is? Bitcoin thrives with the network effect, and that means you need to have young, vibrant people exchanging it all the time to keep the value higher. If people stop using Bitcoin, then its value will decline. And therefore, in an environment which are suppressive or disruptive, then it's less likely that network will be so strong.